As we celebrate Black History Month, certain names are top of mind, like Hank Aaron, a legend on and off the field from his home run record to his philanthropic endeavors. But tonight we're shining a spotlight on his widow, Billy Aaron, who was by his side for decades while breaking racial barriers of her own. She is a legend in her own right, spending a large part of her 86 years of life serving her community and moving them forward. After being raised in Texas, she moved to Atlanta in 1958 to continue her education. She tells us as the civil rights movement began to take shape, she was hesitant to take part at first because of the dangers to her and her family. My first husband and I drove down to Montgomery, Alabama to um, so he was going to speak at Martin Luther King Jr.'s church, Dexter Avenue Church. And we stayed with Coretta and, and Martin during that time. And I was very, very much afraid to even spend the night with them because their home had been bombed. So I had some misgivings. But the whole thing was that it began to sort of take hold, the idea. And she says the idea continued to grow when she saw women like Coretta Scott King active in the movement, supporting the men of the movement. And it just sort of dawned on me that, hey, women can, can be active in the community too. So why don't I give it a try? Why don't I do what I can to get involved? She shattered glass ceilings for black women in media as well, becoming the first black woman to co-host a daily talk show in the Southeast. And years later, she continued her career serving as the development director for the Atlanta branch of the United Negro College Fund or UNCF, all while simultaneously teaching at HBCU campuses across the South. After retirement, she and her husband, Hank, began the Chasing the Dream Foundation, giving students from underserved communities a chance to further their educations, a legacy she hopes will last long after she's gone. One of the first leaders of Atlanta that I met when I first moved here, and I have been impressed ever since meeting Billy. You can find more stories honoring Black History Month by going to our website, 11alive.com slash blackhistory.